everybody, my name is Spring Bunny, and today we're gonna be playing Five Nights at Freddy's Big Racing Raiders. And today it's gonna start a new. It's day. a new day. It's your time to shine. It's time to take your career Where into your own hands. Again. You've saved money your whole life. Great. Now it's time to put all your eggs into one basket and take a huge gamble on your future. A gamble that comes with a 100% chance of success in some cases. What are we talking about? We're talking about... Wait, it's going to skip that because it's very long. Let's see how much cash you had left over after purchasing your franchise package. Okay. Great. That should be more than enough. Now let's get started. On your left are your product catalogs. You can unlock more expensive catalogs by simply purchasing items for your pizzeria. Use the arrows in the bottom right of the item window to browse the products for each catalog. When you're finished shopping, Click the button labeled Blueprint Mode to place your items. You can switch back and forth between Catalog Mode and Blueprint Mode as often as you like before opening your doors to the public. When you're ready to open your restaurant for business for the day, Got some money. A hundred and kids. Another hundred. And another hundred. Let me give him something. Okay. Let's try and get a decent amount of pounds. I guess. This, this game is. This game is totally rigged. That friend is in your video. Got a hundred pounds. Another hundred pounds. And final pounds. Boop, that's some money. Oh, I guess not. Guys, I think we should go ahead and buy something. Let's buy a stage. Put back a bab. Oh, man. 500. Another 100. And another 500. 1,100. That's a good amount of pounds. So we buy a five happy flag. Play some full pack the bag. Okay. A oh, hundred pounds. Let's 
Tomorrow, go go face us Fred back. We'll play the, the second night, and I guess Tuesday. Your restaurant is now officially open. We have asked everyone to order another pizza. There shouldn't be any animatronics. I don't know if this is great tonight. But the workers are working really fast. I'll have to run that glitch. See if I can fix it, because we don't want to do one there. Because that's cheating. Must be a glitch. Well, I'm just supposed to make the video fucking shit. It has been so many. Also, guys, this game is really fun so far. We're gonna go back and also play for that one again. Do you never finish that series? So we go ahead and do that. I think Chica's gonna play the next night. Okay. Great job. It looks like you're getting the hang of this. Yeah. Now let's just focus on getting you through your first week. Okay. There's a big party here Saturday. And you should view that day as your ultimate test. Okay. Make it through Saturday. You know Let's just take a break. Congratulations on completing your first day. However, your job okay. isn't over just yet. Okay. There is another aspect to that your end of day routine, and that is inspecting and salvaging any animatronics found in the alley outside the back door. Things are found here quite often, and while we aren't sure why, what we do know is that they can be used for parts, which can mean a much needed revenue boost before starting your next day. Ooh, okay. Of course, as with everything else in this line of work, those benefits come with risk. The safest okay. thing to do is to throw it back outside, okay. but then Ooh, you get no money for the salvage. Choose to keep it and you run the risk of certain negative consequences, namely death should the item in question not be as docile as it first appeared. If you do decide to try to salvage it, then you must complete the maintenance checklist. During this testing phase, check on the animatronic frequently. If you feel that it is becoming unstable, use the taser provided to you. You can use it three times without damaging the hardware. Every use over three, however, will decrease the item's salvage value. Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. We are unsure of its origins. It is your job to complete the maintenance checklist before claiming it as salvage. Or, if you choose to, you can throw it back into the alley where you found it and forfeit payment. Please make your choice now. Well, also gonna face salvage, the more money. You have chosen to proceed with the maintenance checklist. Remember, Use your company-issued taser to return the animatronic to a neutral state if you feel that it's becoming unstable or aggressive. You can only use it three times before it begins to damage the animatronic and decrease its value. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Dr. 
document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. So thanks, and I don't think we ever played for F6 on the channel. Ah, so I didn't think. Ah, been so long. We got a little bit of revenue at least. 330. Oh, it's been my down. I wonder why. Oh, so it moves the rock stars. Half the rock stars be my down. Six hundred now. Hmm. Okay, uh, I guess we we'll leave uh, the next up to go to Freddy. See what he does. Anyways, yeah, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Subscribe to the channel, really helps me out. And I'll see you guys next time. <laughs> it's happened to the next video.